Hi, I'm Brian from Guildhall Pictures. We're all in lockdown right now and looking for things to do, so we've taken our two passions, cinema and cocktails, to come up with a series of videos showing you how you can make the drinks from the films you love using what you've already got at home. So let's go. The French 75 needs four ingredients. Again, nice and simple. Firstly, vodka. Then we need the good old fashioned lemon juice. As well as that, we're gonna need sugar. We've got caster sugar. And finally, you need champagne. But we can't afford champagne, so we're going Prosecco. Firstly, we are going to need to chill our glass. It's a really important part of making a good cocktail because there's nothing worse than having a great cocktail that ends up being in a warm glass. So just give it a little move around and let the ice sit there while you make it. First ingredient then, we're gonna need 50 ml of vodka. Now, this is gonna be poured on ice in our makeshift shaker, okay? So we've already got some ice in there. I'm gonna add a little bit more just so that we've got enough. The trick is to have lots of ice so that it doesn't dilute too much and spoil the drink. So, 50 ml of vodka. In she goes. Next, we're gonna need the lemon juice. 25 ml of that. And finally, we're gonna need two good spoonfuls of sugar. Lid on, nice and tight. Let's give it a shake. It's really important to shake as hard as you can, a really hard shake to make sure everything mixes, to make sure that the ice breaks up. Don't worry about how your face looks, everybody's looks bad. Okay, that hopefully should be about enough. When it's a bit too cold to hold, that's roughly when you're ready. Hear that fizz, lovely. So, we need our glass back. Let's empty out our ice. Just get rid of that little extra bit of water. And now, we need to drain, or strain, what's in this jug. Not the easiest from a jar with a lid, but if you turn the lid upside down, really helps. And just go through your small sieve with it. Get a bit of height if you want, give it a bit of drama. Perfect. Finally, our Prosecco. Probably should be champagne, but we're going Prosecco. We're just topping off the glass and making the perfect drink. And as simple as that, there you have it. The French 75 from Casablanca. Simple as that. I hope you didn't waste too much vodka trying to do that awkward pour and sieve in it from the jar. Um, obviously, lid upside down always helps, but you know, you'll get the hang of it. Trust me, you're gonna have to. Um, there's one thing left for us to do, and that's to get the taste test from our resident cocktail queen, Sinead Beverland. Hi, Brian. <laughs> Sinead, that was exuberant, love it. Um, so this week, or today, I should say, we have done the French 70... Wait. Why have you done that? Casablanca, he's looking at you, kid. <laughs> awesome. Okay, so here's the drink. Mm -hmm. Try it out, mm -hmm. let us know what you think. I've got one myself. That is good. You like? I give that a strong four and a half crowns out of five. Whoa, you heard it. Four and a half crowns out of five. Now that's massive, and I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to live up to that every single time but I'll give it my best shot. So it's a nice easy drink to make. We'll recap for you now, but don't forget, we're gonna be making another one of these drinks real soon. So maybe subscribe or follow us, and then you'll see what our next drink is for a film you love. See you then.